What's up guys, in this video I'm going to share with you 5 important beliefs that you have to keep in mind when you're approaching girls in order to be successful. You guys know that according to YouTube analytics, over 70% of the people who watch our videos have not subscribed to the channel. So before we get into this video, I want all of you guys to hit the subscribe button and comment below, I subscribe, and we will do our best to personally respond to every single comment. So as I've talked about in other videos, your results with women, especially when you're approaching, is gonna be determined by two things your inner game and your outer game. Outer game is the things you do, the tactics you use, how you flirt with her. Inner game is your key beliefs and that's gonna manifest in your body language, your vibe, you know, the kind of stuff you come up with, how you carry yourself, right? And inner game is extremely important, right? You can't just have the outer game and just forget about the inner game. So in this video, I'm gonna share with you five important mindsets that you know I think it's essential to have in order to skyrocket your inner game. So the first one is actually pretty straightforward. You wanna assume attraction. So a lot of guys, when they approach girls, right, they're just like trying to make the girl attract it's like oh how do i how do i make her attract to me how do i make her attracted to me but that's not a good mindset to have do you think leonardo DiCaprio would be trying to make a girl attracted to him or would he just assume that the girl is already attracted right so when i'm talking to girls i don't try to build attraction i don't even try to build comfort the only thing i try to build is sexual tension i just focus on creating as much sexual tension as possible right and just assume that by default the girl's already attracted to me now look not every girl is actually going to be attracted to you but it's much better to have that mindset of assuming attraction than trying to create it number two you have nothing to lose Think about this logically, right? You see a girl, you're nervous, right? You, you're not sure if you should approach her or not, but what do you have to lose by approaching her? The worst case scenario is you'll be exactly where you were before you approached her, right? You, ha you can't go down, you can only go up, but you know, on the upside, you can get a phone number, you can sleep with her, she can become your girlfriend, she could even become your wife, right? So it's a, basically, it's a gamble where you have, you can only gain, you cannot lose. But the problem is a lot of guys like, ah, oh, fuck, you know, I, th I don't wanna be laughed at, you know, everyone's gonna look at me, some guy's gonna come up and be my ass, but none of that happens. No no one gives a shit, no one's looking at you, no one gives a fuck, you have absolutely nothing to lose by approaching girls. The third mindset, just by approaching, you've already won. So if you have a choice between not approaching a girl and just walking away and approaching her and being blown out within the first 10 seconds, the latter is gonna be a lot better, right? Because you're taking action. And what you're doing every time you approach a girl is you're reprogramming your subconscious to be a man who takes action. Every time you see a girl that you want to approach and you don't, you're programming your subconscious to be a man that just lets opportunity slip through his grip, right? So it's important to, when you see a girl that you want to talk to, to actually go up and talk to her, right? And again, like I said in the previous point, you have nothing to lose. And just by approaching her, just by taking action, you've already won. You've already kind of pushed down your approach anxiety. You've already programmed your subconscious to be a man of action. Number four, girls like being approached. So there's this misconception in the black pill community that all oh, girls don't want to be approached or they only want to be approached by chats. If you guys watch when I do this podcast, every single girl I ask on the podcast, do you like the idea of being approached by a guy? They always say yes. They're like, yes, I prefer meeting guys in real life. I would rather meet a guy during the daytime than at a club or on Tinder, right? So girls like to be approached and even if your approach doesn't go well, you're still taking a step in the right direction. And the last mindset goes into qualifying, and that is I'm gonna find out if this girl is right for me, right? So what most guys do is they try to qualify themselves. Like, oh, let me explain to this girl why I'm right for her. But that's the wrong mindset to have because at that point, you're becoming the seller, right? And you always wanna be the buyer. A better mindset is to see, okay, Let's see if she fits in. Yeah, this girl is attractive, but let me find out if there's more to her than just looks, right? And this is gonna be very attractive to women because women like a guy who's a challenge. Women like a guy who's not sold on them. Women don't like a guy who's chasing them. That's why it's important when you're talking to a girl, you know, to find out if she's actually right for you instead of the other way around. All right, hopefully you guys found this video valuable. And the last key mindset that's important to have is that of a guy who smashes the subscribe button. And you guys can act on that by hitting like, hitting subscribe, and clicking the bell for notification. Thank you guys for watching, and until next time.